Hey, 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 I'm Rod Bergeron, and today we're at the Inner Harbor here in Coburg, Ontario, and we're doing some field studies. And so the way that field studies differ from an en plein air work is typically field studies are quicker, they're shorter, quick little drawings to help you do a completed work later. So um, I would say most field studies should depend upon the acronym FTE, focus, thumbnail, edit and you'll see as I'm moving the camera around here today there's lots of stuff to look at there's piles and piles of stuff to look at but at some point you have to focus and you have to pick a particular thing so I've picked this little sailboat and this piece of the pier right here and that's where I'm going to start today all right so I got my little uh, book here and we're going to get to a blank page this is probably as good a one as any. Actually, it's not. All right, so we'll get to a blank page. And as I'm looking at that little sailboat and I'm looking at that pier, I'm thinking about the rule of thirds and I'm thinking about focus thumbnail edit. So I'm going to put this um, sailboat and this pier on the one third line. So I'm going to start with the sailboat and I'm going to put it, you know, one thirds right here. Again, we're not really too worried about all this stuff when we're doing a, a field study. A field study is just a quick little trying to figure out how this boat sits in the world and all of the things that we can do to put it onto the page accurately and make a historic representation of this thing. This is the little pier. Uh, behind this boat here there's a little canopy that sort of comes up like this but right behind this is a little flower pot thing and then there's some seated benches and another little flower pot on the other end and there's this 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 comes across like this something like that and again I'm not worried about getting this all on the page correctly I'm just worried about right now I'm just worried about getting it on the page so I have a preliminary sketch to work from later there's a light standard here and there's a light standard further down here This, this isn't quite right. We'll make it right though. Something like that. This pier is going to continue down along there like that. And then down here we have another one of those little seats. And I'll try to do this one a little bit more correct. So that I have an accurate representation of it when I go to do my final piece of work. That's probably a little better. So in your um, in your field study you're trying to do things and then correct things and you're trying to do them right on the page. Alright so you can see there's a little bit of a silhouette here of this sailboat. The main mast comes right up here and this comes down to the front here and then there's a couple of lines that are doing that and then there's a couple of more that come down here like this so then you could put in some hatching here This all comes across like that. And now hold on. When you land on a beach, normally you'd run right up. Alright. This is coming off not too bad. So that's all I really wanted to do for this 
little study. Um, again, I'm just out here. I'm just trying to have some fun with it. I'm trying to put some things on the page to try to organize how a bigger, more complete drawing would be. All right, there we go. That's a, not a bad little field study of a boat in the Colbert Harbor. And so I would probably mark this, you know, I'd probably put the date and where I was and everything on this. If you learned anything from this, please give me a like. If you are currently a subscriber, I thank you very much. And if you're not currently a subscriber, please consider subscribing to my channel. Thanks a lot for checking me out. I hope you uh, do some field studies. See you again real soon.